Hey guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing and we appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this gear. This is Canon Pixima TX 5350A. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, triple and one if you like. In the sense you can copy, scan and print from this gear. This printer, I'm going to show you how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. But before we do that, I'm going to give you an overview of this printer. I'm going to start from the back. If you have any paper jam, open up this section. I do get a lot of questions about paper jam. This is where to check for any paper jam and debris. The serial number for this printer is right here in case if you need to contact Canon. Okay. And this is the power cable. Uh, three pin power cable is included in the packaging. Just above the power cable is the USB cable spot. This is the USB cable. Unfortunately, it's not included in the packaging. We have this at Vinyl Textile free delivery here in UK and it's universal. Canon can use it. Epson can use it. HP can use it. Okay, just need to push it inside. It's in and this flat end goes to the back of your PC. Okay, once it's back of your PC, then download the software for you to connect this printer but if if we are using your smartphone then you can get this software by going to google play store and download canon uh, inject selfie okay and for you to connect this printer so this is the usb cable is very handy now i'm going to turn this from the back here this is the rear paper tray this printer got two paper trays the rear one and the front one so you just need to select load particular one then you select where you want to print from okay so this is rear paper tray you can load various sizes of paper and adjust it okay so i'm going to turn this print around okay here is the scanner flat bell scanner load your id card document whatever you want to copy or scan on top of the scanner and select the function okay from the panel just gonna leave this printer up Okay, right now we leave turn this printer up. I also want to mention that here we go. If if you want to close this printer while it's up, you need to go backwards movement and close it front. Okay, if you just lift it up and want to go straight front, you're going to break it. So you need to go backwards and form for you to close it. Here is the end cartridges holder. It's using five six zero and five six one. Okay, five six one is color. 560 is black check my video how we loaded the ink very nice and dope okay and also i'm going to close this now from the panel here this is the front okay so here is the front casket okay so this is the front casket so you just need to adjust this load particular paper you want okay so press here okay for you to adjust it to the size you want or to extend it okay so this is the full length So this is the full length and use the cover to cover it up. Okay. Now from this arrow, you turn this printer on and off from right here. Okay, this is the on and off button. And this button here is for the 
with grain on top of it is for you to copy or start your work you want to do the one with bit of red on top is for you to cancel okay then you can see okay button and also up and down arrow and also arrow for you to go back likewise arrow to identify your proximity for this printer so this is the overview of this printer okay you can see right now if you look here you can see it's telling us manual start setup okay so right now if you want to start setup click ok okay right now it's telling us press ok okay to display the code press ok right now the other thing is asking us is for us to load the paper tray so what i'm going to do right now is for us to basically connect this printer to wi-fi network and then then the next thing we need to do is to load the paper tray okay and for us to do that so what we need to do is we'll go back to our mobile device okay and search for this printer and to do that i want us to have my mobile device right here so what we need to do is look for this printer is the next we need to do and to do that download canon okay canon inject self is already downloaded on my phone so what we need to do right now is see search available printer click search for available printer so you can see it's searching for available printer set up wi-fi for the following printer i can see if you find the printer canon ij4011 tx5000 click ok okay so right now it's processing so it will tell you follow the instruction on your computer or smartphone One thing I noticed the Wi-Fi network is going off on and on. Okay. Um, so I'm going to go back and look for go to the Wi-Fi network. So go to the settings and go to wireless network. Okay. And once you go to the wireless network, okay, you can see here is the Canon Inject Self. Click on it. Okay. So click ok so right now we are t trying to set up this printer here we go so right now i can see select wireless network so right now i can see select wireless router so here we go right now i'm going to put the password for this printer okay so what we need to do is right now i got the details i need to put the password for this printer Okay, and once you put the details, click OK. Okay, we tell the information sent, click OK. Right now, it's communicating with the printer. And also, it will tell you, please wait momentarily. Right now, it's communicating with the, with the printer. It's what it's telling us, please wait momentarily. Sometimes, easy easy wireless connect has been completed okay so right now is completed on the printer already it's telling us please wait easy wireless connect has completed click ok okay so right now is connected but you need to wait for this to complete to complete on the mobile phone okay so right now this printer is connected to wi-fi network but please wait for this to be completed on your mobile device then you know that here we go you can see 
now choose your favorite photo to try it out so once you're done once you connect this printer to wi-fi network it will see it will show you good mark and show you the printer okay so you can actually select image and print if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe um sometimes you know if you want to do this sometimes it, 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 you might have a little of issue so just trying to sort it out like making sure that uh, you connect your printer to the same network okay and for you to connect it to wi-fi network right now this printer is connected to wi-fi network okay and let's also show you from the printer and the app okay if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe this printer right now is connected to wireless network thank you and stay blessed thank you